Imagination at its finest. This panel presents a way to go faster than light in a funny manner, and it's very interesting. It's impossible to go faster than light according to Einstein's theory of relativity. That means if you want to visit the dusty spiral galaxy and you could travel at 99% the speed of light, it would take a staggering 62 million years to get there. Faced with such limitations, physicists have imagined a theoretical engine that might allow you to get to a place faster than light can, but without breaking any physical slow. They call it a warp drive. And if you are a fan of Star Trek, then you already know what I'm talking about. Here's the idea. If this is our ship, the warp drive will actually compress the space-time in front of the ship and expand the space-time behind it, creating a bubble of space-time that moves faster than light with the spacecraft inside it. Meaning that as some of you might have realized, the ship itself isn't moving at all. Only the dimensions of its location are changing. It's like standing still on a moving walkway at an airport. You're not actually moving, but you can still cover distance. And because the ship isn't going faster than light in its local space-time, this doesn't break any law of physics but it's not that simple to build the warp drive we would need a huge amount of energy more than we could provide not only that but we would also need exotic matter which is matter with negative energy density. Physicists haven't even confirmed its existence, and even if it did exist, there is no simple step-by-step -step manual on how to make a warp drive. And with all of that said, there is a huge incertitude on what exactly will happen inside of a warp bubble. Some say life won't survive inside because of high temperatures. Others predict the effect of warping space will destroy the destination. And some even argue that warp drives can't go faster than light, because doing so could violate causality, the principle that cause comes before the effect, as you can't eat apples from a tree before it's been planted, grown, and borne fruit. With no exotic matter and overwhelming technological difficulties, a warp drive remains a speculative idea. 